Hello, 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 hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Enjoy your meal, Angie. No se coma, se pero. Right here. Good evening. Thank you. Good evening, Carmen. How are you today? Fine. 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 God. Fine. Thank you. Thanks, God. So you're fine. After a very, very hot day, right? Super hard day. It was very hot. You're right. Now, I think we're going to start because we have six people. Right? We have Angie, Alexis, you, Pedrina. Hello, Pedrina. Hi. And Gabriela. Now, let's start with a very simple question about yesterday's class, right? What do you remember about yesterday's class? When I am going, when am I going to use need to? Need to. Yesterday we saw the, the, the use of need to and have to, right? When am I going to use need to, Angie? Um, need to, need yes. to, uh, I need to sleep. <laughs> I need to sleep very well, very well. And what is the function, Angie, for need to? Um, Wonder what you said. When I am, when, when I'm using need to in my life. Yes. Simple, simple past, eh, perdón, sim, es, en el presente. In the present, yes, yes. yes. But when, mm -hmm. en qué momento, ese es el tiempo que, voy a, que puedo usar. Eh, ¿Para qué lo voy a usar, Nietzsche? En el momento. <laughs> Ajá, ¿en qué momento? En el presente, dicho, sin que. Sí, 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 eso sí. No les niego eso. Pero ¿en qué momento? ¿Para cuál es el uso del, del de need to? Um, Por ejemplo, we use simple present, we use simple present to talk about daily activities and routines. Usamos el presente simple para describir a rutinas, describir, a, eh, describir hábitos o cosas que realizamos de forma diaria. When Ajá. am I going to use me too? ¿Cuándo voy a utilizar me too? Ayer les di la función de me too. Sorry, I'm going to think one. ¿Cuándo? ¿En qué momento? ¿Para qué lo voy a usar? Linda, yo... Someone who wants to help Angie? Um, <clears throat> Alguien que me la ayuda, Angie? Can I? Please share. Yes, Angie, Alexis? Good, good night. Uh, no, good evening. Good evening. Eh, YouTube, vamos a utilizar eh, cuando necesitamos algo. Exactly, very good. When we need something. When we need something, very good. Cuando necesitamos algo, pero algo que sea súper importante de hacer, right? Súper importante de hacer, vamos a utilizar need to, ¿ok? Yes, teacher. Very eh, teacher. good. Yes, ya voy, a, ya voy a encender la cámara, vengo llegando del trabajo, me voy a preparar hoy. Ya lo voy a encender. Ok. Very good, very good. Excellent. And, eh, buena give me an example, Gabriela, of need to. I need, I need to go to the gym. I need to go to the gym, okay? Go to the gym. I need to go to the gym. Excellent job. Very good. Sandrita. Hello, is Sandra here? Yes, I saw Sandrita. Give me an example with okay. need to. Um, I need, uh, I, I need to eat. I need to. Uh, I eat. 
because I am hungry. Okay, I need to eat because I am hungry. Wonderful example, wonderful example. I need to drink water because I'm thirsty. Very good. Carmen, give me an example with need to. I need to go to work early. I need to? I need to go to work early. I need to go to work early. Very good. I need to go to work early. Excellent job. Excellent job. Now we are we're going to work also right here with half two. Okay. We were supposed to work with have to. Tell me what is the use of have to? Um, let me see who else. Daniel, when are we going to use have to? Uh, I need to. Thank you. Just like a seat. No, but tell me, tell me, <laughs> tell me, Miss, I need you. Yo sé, yo sé, me necesito. Okay, no, Amilcar, necesito que me diga la función de have to. I need you to tell me the function of have to. Yo necesito que usted me diga la función de have to. Uh, es, es recuerdo que ayer dijo que Dio un ejemplo de have, que era cuando dijo que necesitaba ir a comprar comida al supermercado porque no tenía comida en el refrigerador. Ajá, ajá, ok, 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 very well, very well. But that was with need to, eso era para need to. ¿Y para have to? ¿Qué hago? ¿Cuál es, cuál es? ¿Cuál es el, 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 el propósito de, de have to? Eh, cuando está haciendo pregunta. When we're making questions, okay. Give me a question. Tell me a question. Dígame una pregunta. Do I have, do I have to send a report? Do I have to send a report? Okay. Do I have to send a report? Okay. Report. Yes, you have to send a report. Okay, excellent job. Excellent job. Pero todavía me deben la función. Yes, tell me. Teacher, sería como cuando tengo que. Have to, yes. Tengo que. I have to do this. Very yes, good. teacher. It, do, we have to use have for rules, for, for something rules. that you have to do. Exactly, exactly. You're going to use have to for rules, for something that is mandatory. For rules. Okay? For rules. Una exactly. regla. De que cumplir una regla, una obligación. Para algo que es una obligación. Exactly. Actually, in English we say, because it's an obligation, right? it's an obligation, obligation. so we use have rule. to. It's rule. a rule. Exactly, it's a rule, you're totally right. When we have a rule, we need to use have to. Excellent. Now, I am going to show you right now because let me see something. Okay, I'm going to show you right now the class. And we're going to do today. We're going to do a lot of exercises. Así que este es el listo, por favor. Vamos a hacer muchos ejercicios. Van a copiar un montón. Así que preparen esa manito. Get ready because we're going to do a lot of exercises. Okay? That's very important for you to know. Eso es importante que sepa. Okay? Okay, now let me show you here. Can you see my, no, you cannot see my computer. Okay, yep. Here. 
first activity that we're going to do right now, or besides, we know that we are in unit two. This is video conferencia numero nueve. Have to and need to practice. Have to and need to practice, okay? We're going to start with the practice of here. Let's stop. What are some obligations at your work? What are some obligations at your work? This is the question. Keep this question in mind and tell me, think about what are some obligations at your work? In my place, in my workplace, I have to, I have to take attendance three times during class. That is my obligation, right? What is one obligation for you, Sandra? My obligations are success and send I, Okay, uh, now you just have to, I have to. Remember, uh, it's an uh, obligation. Uh, I uh, okay. I I uh, how to um paper reports in the uh, in the my computer and and how to tax this the day uh the day do they do they get a fecha limit Eh, declarar los impuestos en la fecha límite, <coughs> taxes, and how to I have to declare taxes on the due date. Teacher, okay. what is the difference, sorry, what, what is the difference between due date and deadline? There's no difference. Due date, due date and deadline are the same, okay. fecha límite. Okay, thank you. Hi, coloque la lámina anterior. Why? The lámina anterior solo tiene los objetivos. Y conferencia nueve. Okay. Esta es la pregunta. No, but this is the question. Can you see the question? Pueden ver la pregunta? Can you see the question? Yes? Yes. 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 Okay, very good. Josué, what are some obligations at your work? Uh, my obligation, uh, number one, I check report, I check indicator, I supervise. Okay, now you have to for that? You have to? Use have to in sus oraciones, por favor. I have to. I have to check report. Uh -huh. I, I have to, to uh, check indicators. I have to check indicators. Excellent. What else? Uh, I have to check layout. I have to check. Layout, diseño. Okay, the designs. Okay, very good. Very good. Tell me what are some obligations in your work, uh, Carmen? I have, I have to check the financial report. I have to... I have to, to do interviews with the bidder. I have to get meeting with my team. I okay. have I have to I have to give the I have to give the they I have to create indicators. I have to create indicators. Okay, very good. Very good. 
Let me see here. Now, we're going to continue here with, with the next question. Right here, let me show you. And this is something that we're going to do individually, and then you're going to share your answer, okay? This is the practice that we have, the match, right? And this is a practice with me too, okay? This is general vocabulary. It's a vocabulary in it, right? And it says number one, right? I want to go to London. I want to go to London. Number two, can you please read number two, Alexis? She wants a new tablet. She wants a new tablet. Excellent job. Tablet. Number three, read number three, Josue. Oh, suitcase is very heavy. Our suitcase is very heavy, very good. Number four, Pedrina. Number four. Quiero ver, espérame. Permítame. Solamente léalo. No me va a responder ah, ahorita. Ok. Or, or, Number four. Number four. The train is late. late. The, the train is late. Very good. The train is late. The train is late. Excellent. Um, Asalia, number five. Good evening. I want to buy, to buy a train ticket. I want to buy a train ticket. Good. Now let's go with letter A. Letter A, please help me out, Amilka. Letter A. I need to use the left. Okay, we need to use the left. Very good. We need to use the left. Okay. Now left is what do you think left is? Left is elevador. Okay. We need to use the left. Elevador. In in this is another way because in American English, in American English, we say elevator. Okay, and this is British, British English. We say left, okay? Left or elevator, okay? Now, letter B, Gabriela. You need to wait to wait at the waiting room. Very nice. You need to wait at the waiting room. Angie, no, let her see. I need to go to the ticket office. Very good. Carmen, let her see. I need to take the 210 train. Okay, very good. I need to take in, in, uh, in British English, right? This will be two ten. Ellos solamente le ponen un puntito acá a la hora. Right? Nosotros le ponemos dos puntitos. It's going to be the same. Okay? Very good. Thank you. Two hundred and ten. No. It's the hour. It's, it's the, the hour. hour. Ah, okay. Okay, very good. So what would be the, the correct way? Then Carmen? I need to take the two, 210 train. The 210 train, excellent, excellent. And the last one, letter E, please help me out, Ricardo Gabriel. Hola. Read letter E. Uh, she needs to buy a new one. She needs to buy a new one. Very good. Now, what are we going to do? We are going to match. We're going to match here with the correct answers. The numbers with the letters, okay? 
do we have? Number one says, I want to go to London. I want to go to London. What do you, do you think the complement is? I need to take the 210 train. I need to take the 210 train. Okay. I don't know. Right now, that's the answer you're telling. Is that correct? Right now, you are going to work individually. Please take a screenshot. Take a screenshot. Vamos a trabajar de forma individual. Please take a screenshot. And we are going to solve this puzzle. ¿Ya tomaron el screenshot? Yes. No, teacher, no, todavía no. Yes. Pedrin. Okay. Hoy sí ya? Yes, teacher. Very well. So let's work together right now. Let's, we're going to have a couple of minutes. I am going to call the attendance while you work. Let me go ahead and continue here. Give me one moment. Oh my God. Okay, Ana Gabriela Córdoba de Samayoa. Present. Ángela de Jesús Santa María Juárez. Present, teacher. Very good. Azalia Melanie Guardado Portillo. Present, teacher. Carmen Lizette Hernández Escobar. Present. Cilia Jasmin Castro de Chévez. Present. Daniela Mirka Sandoval Avila. Present. Emerson Javier Rivera Rojas. Emerson, José Alfonso Palma Mejía, Juan José Hernández Hernández. Amiga, ¿qué es Lee? Presente. ¿Qué es Lee? Leida Susana Sorto Cuadra, Luis Armando Ventura Campos, María Concepción Cerón Jovel, Pedrina Iliana Gómez Ortega. Presente, teacher. Ricardo Alexis Fuentes Rodríguez. Present. Ricardo Gabriel Varenga Ventura. Present. Roxana Yanira Mejía Escobar. Sandra Gladys Méndez de Barahona. Jennifer Avidaí López Espoto. Ok. We continue here. Ok. Did you finish the exercise? Present teacher. Hi. No, falta, falta. Falta, falta, okay, falta. No teacher, no teacher, espérame que... Ahí me corté. Lo espero, lo espero, no worries. Yes, I finished. You finished, very good.
Let me know if you have a question. If you don't understand something, let me know. I will give two more minutes so we can we can move to the next exercise, okay? Yes. Very well. Do we have the answers? Teacher, literal, say letter. Letter, letter. Le letter. Letter, letter. Porque letter es otra cosa. Little Caesar. What? Little Caesar. Uh, yes, that could be another one. Yes. Can I check the exercise? Who finished? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay. Finish. Very good. Let's check here. Okay. Now we have here the number one. Do you think number one is I need to take the 210 train? Is that the correct answer? Yes. 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 I need to take the train, the 210 train. Okay. Okay. She wants a new tablet. Sandra, the answer. She needs to buy a new one. He needs to buy a new one. Okay. She needs to buy a new one. What do you have for number three? Our suitcase is very heavy. Pedrina. Ahorita vengo, teacher, que me levanté. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. Alexis, what do you have on number three? Um, is, our suitcase uh, is very heavy. Letter A. Uh, A. A. Letter, repeat, letter. Letter, letter A. Mm -hmm. Read letter A. ¿Qué dice letter A? No sé. Digan. We need, need, need to use to. You say they live. No, léalo bien. 
sí se puede. Espérenme, Tiche, espérenme, espérenme. Hoy sí, hoy sí, es que el micrófono no ha funcionado. El micrófono va. We need to, need to, eh, you say they live. Left. They live. They live. Per, they live. 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 Okay. Repeat with me, Alexis. We need to yes, use yes. the live. We need to. No, no separe el need to de, de la palabra. Escucha. ¿Cómo? We, dígame, dígame, dígame. We need to use the lift. We need to to believe. No lo separe el, el to y el use. Punto. We need to use the lift. We need to use the lead. To use. Repeat. To use. To use. To use. We need to use the lift. To use. We need to use to use. Ay, ah, yo ya no. me enredé todo. No haga pausa, por favor. No haga pausa. Escúchame. No haga pausa. We Ajá. need to use the lift. Usted está parando acá la pronunciación. No, no la pare ahí. Sígala. We need to use the lift. We need to do split. Good. If. Good. Good. Very good. Now, uh, let's continue. Celia, what do you have for number four? The train is late. You need to wait at the warning room. You need to wait at the warning room. At the waiting room. Okay, repeat with me. You need to wait. At the waiting room. You need to wait at the warning room. Waiting. 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 You need to wait at the waiting room. Repeat. You need to wait at the waiting room. You need to wait at the warning room. Excellent. Very good. Very good. Now, number five, please. Number five, please, and let's continue. Daniela Milka. I want to buy a train ticket. I need to go to the ticket office. I need to go to the ticket office. Excellent job. I need to go to the ticket to the ticket office. And that is, guys, the tripachuca for this exercise. Do you have a question? Eh, teacher, esto, esto de la pronunciación de la parte de esa need to, eh, tiene que ser un solo. Porque es, que, estaba... es que usted está pronunciando así. We need to use the lift. No, we need no. to use the lift. Esa es la pronunciación correcta. Tiene que unir las palabras. Si no suena como un robot. Y yo no quiero que We suene como un robot. To... Use the lift. We need to use the lift. Very good. Así es muy diferente. Very good. Um, okay, okay, teacher. Okay, very nice. Any other questions about this? ¿Alguna otra pregunta acerca de esto? Questions? Vocabulario, pronunciación. No entendió qué estamos haciendo. Dígame ahorita. Sí, teacher. Yes, señorita. O lift. Lift o lift. 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 Okay. Lift. Porque left, left, right. Sí. Right. Right and left. Right and left. Derecha, ah, okay. izquierda. izquierda. Pero este, este es lift. Esta es lift. otra palabra. Lift. Ah, okay. Good question, okay. Sandrita. Consult. Azalia. Consulta, teacher. Sí, este. Lo que entiendo yo como. <risa> No es que casi no le, no le entendí, pero me entiendo yo que es como el complemento de lo que está en la primera parte, ¿verdad? Lo, exactly, exactly. Ayer estábamos okay. hablando, Entonces, we were talking about necessities, Asale. Y para, para complementar nuestras necessities, que es la, el ejemplo que dio a Milcar ayer, que, que me recordó a Milcar, por ejemplo, I need to go to the supermarket. I need to go to super selectos. 
I don't have food in my fridge. Okay. I need to go to the, the super selectors. I don't have food in my fridge. Entonces, está expresando la necesidad. Y está, esto lo estamos haciendo para dar más contexto. Y no quedarnos solamente con oraciones, eh, con oraciones simples. Right? Ya queremos ir ampliando okay. un poquito más el vocabulario. Good, Asalia. Any, any, anyone else? Yes. Yes. Eh, ¿Cómo se pronuncia yes. eh, la parte de la oración 3? Our suitcase. Our suitcase. 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 Our suitcase is very heavy. Our, our suit, suitcase. Okay, yes. And then, Amilcar, the, the pronunciation is, oh, let me see, ya olvidé la palabra que empezó. The pronunciation is waiting. The letter T is pronounced as a letter R. Waiting. Waiting. Okay? Repeat with me, Daniel. Waiting. Waiting. Exactly. I'm waiting in the waiting room. Estoy esperando en el salón de espera. O en la sala de espera. Okay, very well. Let's continue. Let's continue with another exercise. Thank you for your questions all. We continue here with other activity, with other exercise. Remember that today's class is practice. Practice. So we're going to practice. What do we have here? It says exercise, whatever, exercise four. Circle the correct answers. Circle the correct answers, my friends. This, this says number one. We have to, we have to answer the questions. What is the correct response here, Carmen? Hmm. Um, the correct is we have to answer the question. Exactly, very good. So we go and we circle, right? We circle. We have to answer the questions. That is the correct answer. We have to answer the questions. And you're going to do the same for the others, for number two, three, four, five, and six. We are doing this exercise again, individually. Okay, we're going to work much individually. Okay, let's go ahead. Please take a screenshot of this exercise. Did you finish? Did you take the screenshot? <clears throat> yes? No? Maybe? Yes, teacher. Okay, very good. Let's go ahead and answer this exercise. I am going to be checking pronunciation, okay? No se me vayan a enojar si los pongo a repetir. Because that is my job. No, no me Teacher is question. Yes. Question. Question. Yes. The sounds. The question. Uh -huh. Question. It, the sound. The first, The letter Q comes from here. Huh. Question. 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 I have a question. I tell. I told that. Question. Question. Wow. There is there is some people in the United States that they say question. I have one friend in Arkansas. Arkansas. She says I have a lot of I have a lot of questions to ask. Uh -huh. So it it will depend of the state. Oh. Depende de cada de cada estado. Okay. Sí, tiene muchas pronunciaciones. Y recuérdense que ya eh, inglés ya no están tan puro como el inglés americano como el inglés británico. Mm -hmm. Okay. But there was a question. Good. Amilka, do you finish? 
teacher, no me salió la captura, oh. me salió negro. No sé si me la puede regresar. Yes, yes. Of course, yes. of course. Yes, 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 yes. There you are. Gracias. Okay. Let me know if you have it. We're missing Maria Concepcion is not here. Uy, qué poquita gente está hoy. Tell me if you have questions. Finish, teacher. Finish, very good. Finish. What about the others? Finish too? Okay, so let's Finish. start. So number one was already done and just going to help me with number two, of course. Give me one second, let's mark number uh, here. Number two, what could be the answer, Angie? Uh, Emma has to go to the study. Okay, read one more time, please. Emma has to go to the study. Very well. Emma has to go to the studio. Very good. Very good. Emma has to go to the studio. Now, number number three. Carmen, you said you have finished? Yes, yes. Uh, do you have to leave now? Do you have to leave now? 
Very good. Do you have to leave now? Do you have to leave now? Excellent job. Asalia, number four. No, I doesn't have to. Okay, okay. Now, Asalia, can I use I doesn't? When do I have to use doesn't, Asalia? No, uh, it's no, I don't have to. No, I don't have to. Sí, Remember? La, la, la primera, sí. Remember that we do not use, we do not use doesn't with I. Mm -mm. Okay. Yes. Thank you, Asalia. Sí. Yeah. Okay, gracias. Okay, okay. No, es que eh, lo estaba confundiendo con el has, pero el has es Our para la has para is for third person. Ajá, para la primera persona. Third, third. Has es para third person. Emma has, Ricardo has, Pedrina has. Third es person. Como decir, sí, ok. Let's see here, uh, Celia, number five, Jake. Jake has to, to wait for Emma. Okay, you have to put the auxiliary, Celia. Celia, don't have to wait for okay. Emma. Celia. Uh, listen to me. J it's okay. a person. Okay, it's a name of a guy. Mm -hmm. Es el nombre de un hombre. J. So if it's a man, if it's a man, right? J is you, I, he, she, we, what is it? The subject pronoun should I use? Is he? He, very good. Can I use don't with he? Don't have. ¿Es posible que use don't with, with he? What is the auxiliary that I use with he and she? ¿Cuál es el auxiliar que utilizo? Yes. Does. Does. Very good. Mm -hmm. So what is the answer? Jay does have to wait for Emma. Jay. Okay. The answer is J. J doesn't have to wait for Emma. Now repeat with me, please. J doesn't have to wait for Emma. J does have to wait for Emma. Wait, 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 wait for okay. Emma. Very good. Alexis, the last one, please. Hey, he has uh, a two uh, in scary. Okay. He? He has two. Okay. Uh, Which uh, one? First scary. or second? First or second? One or two? Uh, one two. or two? Two. Have two. Okay. Two. Now let me ask you this, Alexis. Well, we have have two. Okay. Is he 
third person singular? Eh, no, teacher, es la primera. He has Why? two. ¿Por qué la primera? Scary. ¿Por qué? Porque está hablando de él, de tercera persona. ¿Y qué es él? We are talking about him. Remember, it's third person. We, we don't use have to, okay? It's always okay. conjugated. Right? Singular. It's singular. 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 He has to help care. Singular. singular. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Okay. Very good. So we have the answers right now. Any questions? Alguna pregunta antes que nos movamos al siguiente ejercicio? Do you have any questions? Alguna pregunta? Yes. Eh, se ocupa has en, porque es la regla de la S en los verbos. El verbo has es, es un verbo que tiene que ser conjugado. Sí, pero cuando ocupamos is, she, and it, los verbos sufren una, sufren una variación por la regla de la S. Yes. Eh, este es el mismo caso, ¿no? Sí. Ok. Esa era mi duda. Yes, it's the same case. It's the same case because we're talking in simple present. It's the same case. Good question, Ricardo. Now, let's go ahead and continue with the next exercise here. This exercise is going to be in groups because it's a, it's a long exercise and because it's a conversation, okay? Now, it says here that we're going to complete the dialogue with have to, has, oops, wait, let me stop. Have to, has to, don't have to, or doesn't have to. Okay, those are the options that we are going to use. We are going to do this right now before you copy the conversation. And everyone, please put your pens down, ponga sus lapiceros, lo que sea, por allá, and let's pay attention, okay? Number one, it says, hurry. We, lo único que vamos a hacer es trasladar the options have to, has to, don't have to, or doesn't have to, a eso es fácil hablar. Okay? So we have the first one, hurry up. We get ready to leave. What do you think is the answer here? We hurry. We, we have to get we have to, ready to leave. We have to get ready to leave. Very good, girls. Very good. We have to get ready to leave. Have to. We have to get ready to hurry up. We have to get ready to leave. Leave. Where are we going? To the stadium. Don't you remember? No. You really? You really? Has to. Okay, has to. But it's has you. To. You. Has. Can I use has? You has? Mm. Have to. Or have, have to. to. What? Has to. Oh, normal. Have to. Has to. Normal, como dice normal, okay? You have to. Has you to. have to. You really have to listen to Gary. Listen to Gary. You really have to listen to Gary. I do. I Is do. Emma coming with us? Not today. She. She. Go shopping and buy some gifts. Not uh, today. 
doesn't have to go. She doesn't have to go. Have to shopping. Go shopping and buy some girl. Mm -hmm. Read carefully. If she doesn't have to go shopping and buy some girl. Uh, no. <clears throat> Leamos todo oh, el contexto. No. I do. Is Emma coming with us? Okay. Not today. No, today. She has to has go. To. She has no. to go. Very good. Very good. She has to. She has to. She has to go shopping. No. She has to go shopping no. and buy some gifts. No. Okay. Listen. No. Not today. She no. has to go shopping and buy some gifts. Aren't you going to buy any gifts? I bought all mine yesterday, so I buy any more. Has to. Has to. Azalia, no puedo utilizar has con I. What? I have to. 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 I have I'm going to put have, have to. to. Okay. Read, read the sentence. Read the sentence. I bought all mine yesterday, so I have to buy any more. Does it make sense? I, I don't have to buy any more. I don't have to buy because he bought. Because you bought yesterday. Exactly. Ya lo compró, ya no tiene que. I don't I'm, have to buy any more. Look at this. I bought all mine yesterday. So I don't have to buy anymore. All right. Well, well I, I get something for Alex. I don't have. I don't have to. I don't have to. Okay. Yo le voy a hacer caso. Aquí le voy a poner. Y luego lo analiza. I bought all mine yesterday, so I don't have to buy anymore. All right. Well, I don't have to. I don't have to get something for Ali. Get something. Have to. Huh? Have to. Do I change it? Lo cambio? Should I change this number five? Así lo dejo, lo cambio, lo quito, le pongo. I have to get something for Alex. I have to get something for Alex. Very good, yeah. very good. I have to get something. The other person, the other person didn't buy anything, but this person has to get something, okay? Well, I have to get something for Alex. Well, do that later, okay? Do that later. We go now or will be late. Has to. Can I say has, Pedrina, for we? We have to go now. Have to. Has to. Have to. Okay. Pedrina, ¿por qué vamos a decir we has? Estamos, estamos usando we, eh, estamos el, nosotros. ¿Y es, es we tercera persona, Pedrina? No, 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 no. No, no es tercera. Ok. Entonces, Entonces no. puedo utilizar has. Puedo utilizar has si no es tercera persona. Pedrina. No, no, teacher. No, la puedo. Porque el has, la, el has lo utilizamos en terceras personas. Excelente. Very good. ¿Cuál es la respuesta, Pedrina? Entonces sería, entonces es has tú. ¿Por qué es has tú? Si has tú es tercera persona. Ay, y sí, me acaba de decir que no. Sí, tiene, tiene razón. Es que estoy con we. Entonces sería. We. Sería we. Eh, pero we. Tu compañera acaban de mencionar. 
We have to. 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 Have. Okay. have. Miren acá, no es have, es have. 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 Ponemos have. los dientitos, ponemos los dientitos acá encima del labio. Have. 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 I have. have. I have. have. Y el otro es have. has. Have. Has. Have. Okay. Have. 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 Please don't tell Carrie. I didn't remember. She? No. Please she don't. Huh? She, doesn't, she doesn't have to know. She doesn't have to know. Okay, very good. Oh, que no ven corazón que no siente, lady. She doesn't have to know. Okay, very good. We have a conversation here, very well, very good. Now, we are going to practice this conversation, the pronunciation, okay, in pair. That's what we're going to do right now. Please take a screenshot of, a, of the conversation. Tome un screenshot. Ahora sí, tome un screenshot. ¿Ya lo tienen todos? Ya es teacher. ¿Yes? Ok. Yes. So now we are going to go to work the pronunciation. Ok. In pairs. We're going to be together. Before we do that, let me call the attendance. Ok. Let me call the attendance. Antes que se vayan. Para el grupo. Ana Gabriela Córdoba de Samayor. Present. Ángela de Jesús Santa María Juárez. Present, teacher. Azalia Melanie Guardado Portilla. Present. Carmen Lizette Hernández Escobar. Present. Cilia Jasmín Castro de Chévez. Present. Daniela Mirka Sandoval Avilés. Present. Emerson Javier Rivera Rojas. Luis Alfonso Palma. Juan Josué Hernández Hernández. Leida Susana Sorto Cuadro. Luis Armando Ventura Campos. María Concepción Cerón Jovel. Present. Pedrina Ileana Gómez Ortega. Present, teacher. Ricardo Alexis Fuentes Rodríguez. Yes, teacher, present. Ricardo Gabriel Varenga Ventura. Roxana Yanira Mejíbar Escobar. Sandra Gladys Méndez de Barahona. En Jennifer Aviray yeah. López Escoto. Okay, good then. We're going to start working right now in pairs, right? Pronunciation only. Let's go ahead and practice. Give me one moment. Give me one second. Okay, we're going to start right now. Click on the button, click on yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Choose your button. Let's go. Amilcar Alexis, Maria Concepcion, please select your groups. Eh, usted le toma screenshot a la a la conversación. Sí, pero, pero no puedo compartir la fi, todavía no he aprendido. Vale, no se preocupe. Este, uh -huh. si gusta, yo ya casi estoy en mi casa, pero si gusta, eh, 
Yo la comparto. Hola. Ah, bueno. Bueno, ah, Salia, compártala pues. Y la... Hola, Salia. Eh, bueno, yo creo que es la última, ¿verdad? Sí, la que, la que ya está completa. La que acabamos de completar. Ahorita. Esta. Yes. Yes. Complete. Correcto. Vaya. Esta. Hurry up. We have to get ready to leave. Leave? We are we going? To the stadium, do you remember? No. You really have to listen to Carrie? I do. Is Emma coming with? We have go now or will be late. We have to Please. go now. Please don't tell Carrie. I did remember she doesn't have to know. Boy, two boy, I'm here. Any gate. I both uh mine yesterday, so don't have to buy any more. All right, well, have to get some time for Alex. We'll do that later. We have to go now or well be late. Please do not take carry. I did not remember she does have to. Okay. But but let's go. Please carry. I didn't remember. Ahora cambiemos para hacer la más más larguita uh, empiezo vaya, yo si ser... quiere hoy empiezo yo soy Ramón Va. vaya don Ramón y, de, y después le sigue sale ahí por último Ricardo verdad vaya Harry uh, we have to get ready to leave a salir leave 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 where are go we going Today is study. Do not you remember? Don't you remember? No. You really have to listen to Carrie. Listen. I do. Emma coming with you. No. Today she has to.
Okay, did you practice the conversation? Yes. Yes, okay, very good. Yes. yes. Okay, very good. Asalia, can you share your screen with the conversation that you were doing in the group? Very good. Now we're going to look at Asalia's computer right now. And we are going to start with Angie and Carmen. Make it bigger, 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 bigger. De la ya bajito. Okay, and Going to listen to Carmen and Angie, right? Okay. Okay. Um, I, I will be Ramon. Hurry up. We have to go. Hurry up. We have to get ready to leave. Leave. Where are we going? To the stadium. Don't you remember? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> you really have to listen to Carrie. I I do. Is Emma coming with us? Not today. With us? Not today. She has to go shopping and buy some gifts. Aren't you going to buy any gift? I bought all mine yesterday, so I don't have to pay any more. All right. Well, I I have to get something for Alex. Well, do that later. We have to go now or we'll be late. Please do not tell Carrie. I do not remember. She doesn't have to know. Okay, but let's go. Okay, give them an applause. That was actually amazing. Very good, very good. Excellent job. Excellent, both of you. Now, uh, please, Carmen, choose another person. Are you, uh, see the hello, see the. Carmen? Gabriel? Ricardo Gabriel, are you there? <laughs> Yes, I'm here. Okay, Ricardo Gabriel. Uh, can you please, I don't know, you choose between Astalia or Pedrina or both. Let's do both. Both. Yes, first Astalia and then Pedrina. Okay, first Astalia, yes. Okay. Hurry up. We have to get ready to leave. Leave. Where are we going? To the stadium. Don't you, don't you remember? No. You really have to listen to Carrie? I don't. I do. Is Emma coming with us? Not today. She has to go shopping and buy some, some gift. Aren't you going to buy any gift? I'm both all main yesterday, so I don't have to buy any more. All right. Well, I have to get some time for Alex. We'll do that later. We have to go now or we'll be later. Please don't tell Curry. I didn't remember. She doesn't have to now. Okay, but let's go. Hey, very good, very good. Excellent job both, excellent job. We just need to get some pronunciation straight. Uh, repeat with me, Ricardo, mine. Mine. I bought all mine yesterday. I bought all mine yesterday. Very good. Uh, Asalia, repeat with me. Get something for Alex. Get some time for Alex. Something. Something. Okay, very good. Something. Get, get, get something, something for Alex. Get. Get. Get something for Alex, not jet. Get. 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 Get, get something for Alex. 
Excellent, excellent. Very good. Now, another person, please. Choose another person, Astalia. Oh, Pedrina, Pedrina, Pedrina and Ricardo. Okay. Ahora yo soy Laura. <laughs> Va a ser la, la, ah, yo soy Ramón, ¿verdad? Bueno. Hurry up, we have to get really to live. Live? Where are we going? Do they start do not you remember? No. You really, I have to listen to carry. I do. Is Emma coming with you? No, today she has to go shopping and book some gear. Aren't you going to buy any gift? I book a night yesterday, so I don't know how to buy any more. All right, well, I have to get some time for Alex. We do tie late. We have to go no awake like day. Please don't tell Carrie. I didn't remember. Okay. She have to know. Okay, book. Let's go. Okay, very good. Very good. Very good. Let's continue here. Uh, Sandra, who was your partner? Mm, Gabriela. Gabriela and Sandra. Okay, good. Let's go. Okay. Hurry up. We have to get ready to leave. Yeah. Where are we going? To the stadium. Don't you remember? No. You really have to listen to Gary. I do. Is Emma coming with us? Not today. She has to go shopping and buy some gifts. Aren't you going to buy any gifts? I bought all mine yesterday, so I don't have to buy any more. All right, well, how to get something for Alex? Well, do that later. We have to... Oh. Mm. Sorry. <laughs> Nos vemos. <laughs> well, do that later. We have to go now or we'll be late. Please, don't tell Carrie I did remember. She doesn't have to know. Okay, but let's go. Okay, very good pronunciation, you guys. Very good. Very good. And who is missing? I think we're missing um, Amilcar. Who was your partner, Amilcar? Uh, ya, ya no me recuerdo, teacher. <gasps> Dios mío. ¿Quién fue el compañero de Amilcar, por favor, que me la ayude? O compañera. No me acuerdo tampoco. <laughs> <laughs> María. Una pues, compañera fue. Okay, okay. Celia and Amilcar, let's see. Uh, Celia, for us. Yes. Vamos. Hurry up. Hurry up. We have to get ready to leave. Leave? Where are we going? To the stadium. Do you remember? No. no. You really have to listen to Carrie? I do. Is Emma coming with you? Not today. She has to go shopping and buy some heat. Aren't you going to buy any gifts? I bought. I mean, yesterday I saw. I don't have to buy any more. All right. Well, I have to get some time for Alex. Well, to that later, we have to go now or we'll be late. Oh, well, please. 
Please don't tell Karen. I didn't remember. She doesn't have to know. Very good. Okay, good. Let's go. Okay, but let's go. Excellent, excellent. But you, you need to practice more like uh, not to sound too robotic, okay? Not to sound too robotic. Okay, now who is the next person? ¿Quién falta? ¿Quién falta? Eh, María Concepción, did you already pass? Uh, con Alexis y teacher. Okay, let's go Alexis and María Concepción. Thank you. Hi. Uh, hi. Oops. We have to be ready to leave. Where are you going? Today stadium down. You remember? No. You really have to uh, listen to her. I do. Is Emma coming coming with us? Not today. She has has to go shopping and buy some gifts. Aren't you going to buy a gift? Uh, I I was a mini yesterday, so I don't don't. Don't have to buy any more. Oh, all right. Well, I have to. I have to get something for Alex. We don't. Uh, leave. Uh, we don't. Uh, the little we have to. The no. Uh, or we little. Please don't tell Carrie I didn't remember she doesn't have have to know. Okay, bye. Let's go. Okay, excellent pronunciation, Concepcion. Good job, good job, Ale uh, Alexis. Now let's go ahead and practice with the next activity. Everyone participated right now, right? ¿Todos participaron en esta actividad? Yes, teacher, yes. Ok, sí. very good. Someone here. Thank you, Salia. Ok, Pedrina, if you have to go, Pedrina, that's ok. Si se tiene que eh, ir, Pedrina, está bien, ok, no hay problema. Now, let's go here in, with the pronunciation, ok? It says John and, John and. And John and I. But here, we're just going to see, we're going to listen to Sandra. Sandra, you're going to be Anne, right? And I think Carmen left, right? Because of the internet. So let's see, Ricardo Gabriel, are you here? Yeah. Okay, Gabriel, you are John. Sandra, you are Anne. Let's practice pronunciation and then we move to the next activity. And is there something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, actually, I need to call some clients and you? Well, I have to rush. I don't reschedule. I have to reschedule two meetings for, for tomorrow. They were canceled today. Oh, that's too bad. Yes, I have to provide important information to some customers. That sounds interesting. Ricardo? Yo no tengo más. That sounds interesting. Okay. Now, 
we're going to see here, look at the sentences that we have, right? The sentences they are telling us right now, things that they need to do, right? And look at the question, right? Look at the question. Is there something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, actually, I need to call some clients, right? Now, let me ask you this. Is there something you need to do tomorrow, uh, Ricardo? Repeat again, please. Is there something you need to do tomorrow? I'm using yes. the same question, huh? Yes, uh-huh. Something you need to What do you have to do? What do you need to do in your job? Okay. Uh, I need to have a meeting with my parents. Okay, I need to have a meeting with my parents. Okay, very good. That sounds serious. Okay. Is there something you need to do tomorrow, uh, Sandra? Esta es una pregunta que la podemos hacer nosotros a cualquier momento a alguien acerca de las actividades que ellos van a hacer el día siguiente. Right? Entonces yo le estoy preguntando. Is there something you need to do tomorrow? Um, I need tomorrow working. Need, okay. Look at the answer. I need to. I need to. I need to tomorrow. No. I go. I need to tomorrow. No. Mire la respuesta que le da a a John. Mire la en la conversación. It says okay. there. I need to call. I need Esa to es la call. respuesta de Ana. ¿Cuál es la suya? I need to work in the morning. I need to work in the morning. Very good, Sandra. Excellent job. Angie, is there something you need to do tomorrow? I need um I need to go to the bank. I, need, the to, bank. I need to go to the bank. Excellent. Celia, is there something you need to do tomorrow? I need to write at the work. I need to write at work. Okay. Very good. Carmen, is there something you need to do tomorrow? <clears throat> yes, I need to download files to check them. Okay, very good. Very good. Alexis, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Um, I need to serve a client. I need to serve a client. I need to attend. Okay, remember what I said yesterday. Attention, uh, attention. Assist, assist the client. <coughs> Sorry, assist the client. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Repeat it, please. I need to assess the client. I need to assess the client. Okay. To assess. Okay, good. Um, is there something you need to do? Sorry. Is there something you need to do tomorrow, Ana Gabriela? I need, uh, I need to enter reservation into the system. Okay, excellent answer, Gabriela. What about you, Concepcion? I need a team, uh, manager. I need to assist the manager, okay? I need to assist the manager. Now, when we put the word attend, and I want you to, to, to pay attention to this, the word attend, Significa be present, be at a place, be in a meeting. For example, 
I am going to attend the classes. Porque lo que, lo que sucede, sorry guys. <clears throat> what happens is this, with these two verbs. Con el verbo attend. In, in, in Spanish, we say atender, right? That's what we say in Spanish. Voy a atender a mi jefe, voy a atender a la gente que llegue. So we say atten, atender, right? That's what we say in Spanish. But in English, attend means asistir, right? A las nueve de la noche les digo yo, I am going to take the attendance. Asistencia. La asistencia de que ustedes están presentes en el lugar. So the verb attend means to be present. Significa estar en un lugar. Okay? The other verb that you want to use is assist. Assist viene de asistir, de ayudar. O servir ya no lo utilizamos. Servir ya no lo utilizamos. But it's going to be assist. Asistir. I am going to assist my boss. Por eso es que nosotros lo llamamos I am an assistant. Asalia me dijo una vez, I am an assistant. Sandra says, I am an assistant. Pedrina says, I am an assistant. Son asistentes. Lo que antes era una secretaria. Right? Assistant. ¿Sí se entiende la diferencia de los verbos? ¿Se entiende? Yes, teacher. Yes? Okay. Very well. Very well. Aten, aten is for to be. To be, to be present. To be. I am going yeah. to attend a meeting tomorrow. Okay. Well, and assist. Uh -huh. Yes, sis. I am going to attend a meeting and uh, I am going to assist my boss in the to meeting. To help. To help. Exactly. To help. To help, but so usually you get paid for that. Right? Usually you get paid. Now, let's continue here with the next activity. Okay. Remember the question, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Is there something you need to do next week? Right? Esta nos va a ayudar a preguntar, ¿qué vas a hacer? ¿Tenés que hacer algo la otra semana? ¿Tenés que hacer algo mañana? Right? Is there something you need to do tomorrow? Esa pregunta bien usual. Let's continue. It says here, write something you have to do or need to do these days. That's the first thing. And then it says when, what time, and where. Vamos a utilizar esas tres WH questions. Amilcar, when, what is the meaning of when? What is the meaning of when? When am I? ¿Cuándo voy a utilizar when, Amilcar? When am I going to use when? Asalia. Uh, por ejemplo. Ajá, uh, yes, 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 Amilcar. Por ejemplo, este. Si yo le pregunto a otra persona uh, que si va a ir a, a un lugar. Ok, but that is where. It's a square. Para lugares, es where. Ahí sí. ¿Cuándo? ¿Qué día? Okay. ¿Cuándo? ¿Qué día? ¿Qué día? ¿En qué momento? ¿En qué tiempo? Ok. ¿En qué periodo de tiempo? Ok. Periodo de tiempo. What time, a specific time, where, a specific location, okay? I'm going to use this trick, okay? And look at my example, okay? I need to...
Okay, look at my example. I need to go to the bank tomorrow at 9.30 a.m. Okay, that is my example. I want to make a question with this. When do I need to go to the bank? When do tomorrow. I need to go to the bank? Tomorrow, very tomorrow. good. What time do I need to go to the bank? At night, 9.30. At night, 30, wonderful, wonderful. Where do I need to go? Where do I need to go? To the bank. To the bank. Very good. So we are going to make sentences that have that they actually have these three elements. Okay. Now, once we make the questions, when do you? Esta es la pregunta. What time do you? Where do you? Okay. Those are the questions. When do you need to go to the bank? Tomorrow. What time do you need to go to the bank? At 9.30. Where do you need to go? To the bank, right? Estas tres preguntas te van a ayudar para escribir cosas. Para responder y que vaya similar a su pregunta. Let's go ahead and write our example. This is my example. You write one, ex no, two examples with have to and two examples with need to about your job, about your day, sobre su día, sobre su trabajo, but right, two with need to and two with have to. Is that clear? <clears throat> yes? Okay, very good, very well. Now, take a screenshot so you can have your examples or copy the examples. Teacher, yes. Y podemos usar el das. ¿Ah? Podemos usar el das no. En mm -hmm. alguna por ejemplo, when does the bus arrive from? But in that case, in that case, you are going to be talking about someone else. Puedo utilizarlo, pero en ese caso, todos tienen que ser. She needs, she needs to go to the bank tomorrow at nine thirty. What time does she need to go to the bank? What time, what time does she need to go to the bank? Si la va a escribir con she, todo tiene que ir con she. O con he. Okay? Thank you. You're welcome. Let me know if you have questions. Tell me if you have questions, please. Teacher. Yes? Um, una oración por cada pregunta. Eh, no, 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 no. O todo completo. No. You are going to make two sentences with need to. Two sentences with have to. Okay. okay. Dos oraciones okay. con need to, dos oraciones con have to. The only thing is that they have to have all the elements. Tienen todas que tener los elementos que respondan a la pregunta. When, what time, and where. Por ejemplo, acá podemos ver que la, la, la pregunta tiene where to the bank. When, tomorrow, what time, at 9.30. Okay, 
Entonces, la, la, la oración tiene las posibles respuestas de las preguntas que usted va a hacer. Ok. Ok, very good. Did you finish? Yes. Okay, very good. So let me let me read oh, let me listen to your examples. Okay. Uh, she has to eat. In the night, perdón, she has to eat at night because the medicine must be taken. Okay, she has to eat at night because she must take her medicine. Okay, okay, very good. Now let's make the questions for that. Okay, what time does she have to take the medicine? Uh, at night. That is when. When does she have to take the medicine? At yes. night. Right? Okay. We're uh, missing some elements. Mm -hmm. In the sentences, no, no hay una hora. No le puse una hora. Okay. Remember, it has to have the, uh, the three questions. I when, finished, teacher. What time and where? Okay. Harmony. Okay. Yeah. Tell me one example. Uh, we have, um, I have to check the new hotel booking process tomorrow at 1.30 p.m. Okay. Okay. When do you have to check the, the booking? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. At what time or what time do you have to check the booking? Uh, at 1.30 p.m. Where do you have to check the booking? In, in, in the meeting. <laughs> in the? In the meeting. In, in the a meeting. meeting. In, in a meeting. meeting. In the meeting. meeting. Okay, yeah. very good. In the meeting. Excellent job. Excellent job. Tell me the name of another person. Angie. Angie. Tell me your example, Angie. Ay, teacher. Aún no he entrenado. Hay eran preguntas y oraciones, teacher. No eran preguntas, yo dije oraciones. No. Ah, okay, okay, okay. I need to drink water. Okay. I need to go to the bank. Okay, give me a moment. I need to drink water. water. Mm -hmm. Okay. Listen to me. Listen to me. When do you when do you need to drink water? No me puso when. Uh, 
na puso ah. what y na puso where. ¿Cuándo? Ah. Okay. Fíjense bien, vamos a hacerlo de nuevo. Vamos a hacerlo de nuevo. Tenemos que escribir una oración que contenga los elementos que tienen, que les están preguntando. Oh. Ok. Pongan atención. En este caso, el ejemplo que tenemos dice, I need to go to the bank tomorrow at 9.30. Entonces, los elementos de la oración responden a cada una de las preguntas. Por ejemplo, when do you need to go to the bank? Tomorrow. Um, yeah. What time do you need to go? At 9.30. Okay. Where do you need to go? To the bank. To the bank. Okay. okay. La oración tiene cada uno de los elementos. Carmen, lea mi su oración de nuevo o dígame su oración. Carmen. Yeah. Okay. Um, I have to check the new hotel booking process in the meeting tomorrow at 1.30 p.m. Uy, no fui secretaria. I have to check the new hotel. I, need, I have to check the new hotel booking process. Uh -huh. In the meeting? In the meeting? Tomorrow at 1.30 p.m. At 1.30 p.m. Very good. Now, look at this example, everyone. Look at this example. I am going to ask you right now, Alexis, when do you have to check the new hotel booking process? When do you have to check the new hotel booking process? When? Yes. Repeat, please, teacher, que no, no, no entiendo bien cómo se me viene el inter. When do you have to check the new hotel booking process? Es, vamos ah. a hacer con esta oración lo mismo que hicimos con la oración de ejemplo. Mm -hmm. Check. Teacher, for example. No, to check, no. When do you have to check the new hotel booking process? When? Sandra me dijo, y Andy me dijeron, Angie, que when significaba un periodo de tiempo. Okay? If I ask, when do I have to check the new hotel booking process? What is the answer? Where do you do? Where What do you do? do no. You? no, 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 no. The new hotel. That would be More. what? Eso si le preguntara yo a Milker, what do you need to check? The new hotel booking process. I see. Pero le estoy preguntando when. Tomorrow, teacher. What? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Very good. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Vamos a ponerlo con verde. Tomorrow. Okay. Now, what time do I have to check the new hotel booking process? Sandra? At 1.30 p.m. At 1.30 p.m. Excellent job. At 1.30 Very good. We go with pink. Angie, where do I have to check the new hotel booking process? Um, where, verdad? Um, hotel, new, new hotel. No. Cuando? Ah, when? Where? ¿Dónde? 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 Ajá. ¿Hotel? ¿Booking? No. In the meeting. In the meeting. Very good. In the meeting. Thank you so much, Gabriela. In 
the meeting. In the meeting. We have there the three elements, right? Esta oración tiene los tres elementos. I, I need to go to the bank tomorrow. I have to check the new hotel we can cross. Now, what is another example? Tell me another example. Y lo vamos a hacer juntos. Otra oración que contenga todos los elementos. For example, teacher, I have a dinner Friday at 7 p.m. Ok, en ese caso usted me está usando have como yo tengo, pero no como una obligación. Hágame la esa como una obligación. Podría ser, teacher, I have to go to go to work tomorrow at 8 p.m. Ok. Teacher. Yes. Ok. What is missing here? If we say, I have to go tomorrow at 8 a.m. We say, when do you have to go, Asalia? Uh, teacher, I have to, to go to, uh, to work tomorrow. Me falta ahí. Don't. To go to work, okay. To... Okay. When do you have to go, Asalia? Um, where? When do you have to go? When? Cuando. No lo traduzca, no lo traduzca. Se le va a quedar ese cuando Tomorrow. pegado. Se le va a quedar ese cuando pegado. No solo significa cuando. When? Tomorrow. Very good. Tomorrow. What time do you have to go, Pedrina? Este... What time? What time? Uh, at 8 a.m. At 8 a.m. Okay, very good. Where do you have to go? Where do you have to go, Carmen? At work. Okay, okay. Now, and let's take a look on this. When we say here, the sentence is perfect. Gramaticalmente hablando, la oración que nos dio Angie es perfect. Pero, no nos dice where. Nos dice qué va a ser. What do you have to do to work? I have okay, to no. go to workplace, to, the work, uh -huh. to my workplace. I have to go to work to the office tomorrow at 8 a.m. Si le agregamos to the office, ya vamos a tener un where, un lugar. Pero si lo dejamos así, así como está, la oración está perfecta, no hay ningún It's problema. It's like a verb. Pero está funcionando como un infinitivo, como un verbo, una actividad. I have to go, I have to go shopping. I have to go swimming. I have to go to eat tomorrow. Pero no me está diciendo a dónde, ¿ok? Very good, Angie, very good example. Now, we're going to stop here. We have two more exercises for tomorrow. For tomorrow, escuchen, van a traer sus ejemplos así como los que hicimos hoy que contengan cada uno de los elementos. And we're going to check tomorrow those examples, okay? Esa es su tarea. Okay. Aparte de esa, esa tarea. One example. ¿Ah? Dos One y dos. Example. Dos y dos, así los que, te, los que ya hicieron, perfeccionen, ¿ok? Perfeccionen los que ya hicieron. Ahora, para esta semana, la semana número dos, para la semana número dos, usualmente ya se pide que envíen, por favor, eh, o que recuérdense a los de recursos, recursos humanos, perdón, enviar los documentos de INSAFOR. También eh, hay que estar pendientes de la plataforma, ya completaron todos el midterm las actividades de la semana. Yes, teacher. Yes. Angie, yes. Okay, very good. 
Sí, por favor, traten de terminar las actividades, sobre todo el midterm, las tareas, a más tardar mañana por la noche para poderlas revisar y que no tengan ningún inconveniente. Si hay algún ejercicio que les dé un problemita para resolverlo, no se olviden de escribirme, tomen una captura de pantalla del ejercicio y me avisen, ¿ok? Si están teniendo algún inconveniente con ese ejercicio. Ahora voy a, I'm going to call the attendance, remember, recuerden el meaning de attendance, ¿qué significaba attendance, Alexis? Alexis. Pendientes. ¿Ah? Siguientes. Aquí estoy, teacher. ¿Qué significaba attend? Atender. Atender. No. Estar en un lugar. Visitar. ¿Ah? Estar en un lugar. Estar en un lugar. Estar presente. Asistir. Eso significa attend. Ok, ¿y cómo digo asistir uh, o ayudar? Es que, teacher, es que casi me... Ok, no escuché, Asist. ok, entonces ve el video, por favor. Eh, Alex, vamos a seguir con la asistencia, with the attendance. Yes, Ana teacher. Gabriela, Ana Gabriela Córdoba de Samayoa. Present. Ángela de Jesús Santa María Juárez. Presente, teacher. Azalia Melanie Guardado Portillo. Present. Carmen Lisa Hernández Escobar. Present. Silvia Jasmine Castro de Chévez. Present. Daniela Mirka Sandoval Avilés. Present. Emerson Javier Rivera Rojas. José Alfonso Palma. Juan Josué Hernández Hernández. Leila Susana Soto Cuadra. Luis Armando Ventura Campos. Present teacher. María Concepción Cerón Jovel. Present. Pedrín Iliana Gómez Ortega. Present teacher. Ricardo Alexis Puente Rodríguez. Ricardo Gabriel Alvarenga Ventura. Susana Yanira Menquimel Escobar. Sandra Gladys Méndez de Barahona. And Present teacher. Jennifer Adidaí López Escobar. Now, we're going to finish here. But in the list, I have another person. It's someone called Glenda Esmeralda Trigueros Vasquez. That person doesn't attend class. Is there, is there anybody that wants to take her place today? Tengo a Glenda, que solo vino un día a clases. Alguien que quiera tomar el puesto de ella de los 10 minutos de asistencia. Si no, se pueden desconectar sin ningún problema. Mi teacher. Ok, me quedo con Ángel entonces. Good night. Have a beautiful night. night. Bye, bye. bye. Si quieres, se queda Sandra también, si tiene alguna pregunta. Good night, teacher. Good night. Podemos endosar. Ok. Have a beautiful night. Ok, hello, hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Te van a quedar las dos. Bye. Ay, se fue, sale. A sale, no se vaya. <risa> Te vamos a escribir. Eh, aquí. ¿Dónde estaba sale? Ya la perdí a sale. Eh. Dígame, Angie, en lo que um, era como en los, en los, um, lo que tenía dudas era como en los correos, la redacción. Ah, de la, lo de la primera semana. Sí, la primera semana, porque yo vine como, eh, hubo un día que entré como 20 minutos tardecito, entonces me perdí como y no, okay. y, no y era mentira que, que veo el video porque en el trabajo no hay chance y en la noche, ajá, entonces este eh, no pude como empaparme bien de, de, de la clase Sí, es correcto Bye, mira. Ajá. lo que sucede 
perdón, es que con el video, con el video, con el, el correo, uh -huh. eh, con los correos, los vamos a redactar. Esas son como frases formales que se utilizan en cor corporate English o business English, en inglés uh -huh. de negocios. Uh -huh. es lo que no, es lo que, eso es lo que nosotros queremos utilizar acá, inglés de negocios para comunicarnos con clientes, para comunicarnos con alguien que nos puede ayudar. Entonces nos comunicamos con ese tipo de, 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 correo. de correos. Entonces, la, ah. cada una de las frases que, que yo le estaba mostrando, déjenme ver si la encuentro. Creo que fue la primera, como la segunda clase. La primera o la segunda clase, tiene razón. Ajá. Fue allá, allá, bien lejos. Ajá. Creo que fue la primera. Vamos a ver. Déjame ver, sí. Vaya, le voy a decir acá para que se utilizaron cada uno. Uh -huh. Ok, I have them here, ¿verdad? Entonces tengo acá este primero, please find the touch. Right? Cuando usamos please find the touch. Okay. Eh, we find here Venimos con el please find the touch cuando nosotros adjuntamos un documento. Ajá. Okay. Entonces ponemos this week report, el reporte de esta semana, mi hoja de vida, Ajá. el reporte de ventas mensuales. Entonces, as, así es como tenemos que utilizar cada uno de ellos. Okay. Ajá. Entonces tenemos que poner ahí, please find attached this week report, my resume, the monthly sales report. O cualquier otro documento que vaya usted a attach. Okay? Okay. Please find mm -hmm. attached the pictures. Please mm -hmm. find attached the agenda. Okay? Dependiendo. Luego tenemos acá, eh, cuando usted reenvía correo. Usted reenvía correo electrónico. ¿Cómo no, teacher? Muy okay. frecuente. Uh -huh. Entonces, usted va a poner ahí, I'm forwarding the documents to you. Or, I have forwarded the documents to you. Está reenviando uh -huh. el documento, va a utilizar cualquiera de las dos frases. Las dos significan lo mismo. Okay? Okay. Estoy reenviando el documento. O he reenviado el documento. Este es cuando nosotros copiamos a alguien en el correo. Usted no copia, yo por ejemplo... Cuando yo envío no un copio. correo, copio uh -huh. a alguien más para que esa persona también esté enterada. Por ejemplo, si usted tiene, usted es jefa y usted quiere que su asistente haga algo, pero también quiere que alguien más lo haga o que se dé cuenta, usted uh -huh. va a utilizar eso. I have copied Gabriel on this email to keep him in the loop. To keep him in the loop significa para que esté pendiente o esté atento a lo que está pasando con este correo que viene okay. en Okay. Mm -hmm. Ahora, cuando decimos copy, CC en CID, significa lo mismo. Copiar, ajá. Okay. Copiar. Sí. Y luego tenemos este número 4. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me. Si tienes preguntas, no dudes en, en preguntarme, en contactarme. Okay. Ajá. Eso, eso lo vamos a poner usualmente al final del correo. ¿okay? Cuando ya está escrito, va a, es todo lo que quiere escribir. If you have any questions, please don't uh -huh. hesitate to contact. Si tienes preguntas, no olvides en contact. Y luego el último, que sería I look forward to. I look forward uh -huh. to hearing from you. I, li I look forward to meeting you. I look forward to I look forward to your reply. Okay. Quedo atenta a tu respuesta. Quedo atenta a escuchar de ti. Espero escuchar de ti. O espero tu respuesta. Y al final ponemos el, la despedida que en español, por ejemplo, yo pongo saludos cordiales. Usted puede poner kind regards, warm wishes, regards, or yours truly. Okay. Yours okay. truly. Yours truly es más para algo más. Una, un, cuando usted tiene una relación más eh, 
se confianza de confianza a una persona. Ok, ¿Eh? yours truly. Yours truly. Las otras son eh, bastante neutrales. Man. No están. Ajá, ajá. Uh -huh. Correcto. Ok. Ah, okay. Pues sí, porque yo, yo creo que la agarré como a la mitad, entonces me perdí como lo primero. <risa> okay, okay. Y, y dije yo, no, es que tengo que tener mi turno para, para preguntarle. Para preguntar, pero aprovechame esto. Es para bien. aprovechar. De sí. ahí este... Um, ajá, y ahí ah. hay, hay algo otras como frases que a veces uno quisiera como comprender cuando usted está explicando, ¿verdad? Como para entender. ¿Con cuáles frases? Um, por ejemplo, Lucas, de, no, no sé, usted pronuncia, dice una frase, Lucas de... ¿qué, qué, Lucas de Screen. No, Ajá. Look at the screen es que vean la pantalla. Look at the screen. Ah, okay, okay, okay. O a veces le digo, look at your module. Look at your book. Look at your ah. book es que vean Vean el libro. Vean ah. el libro. Look at your okay. book. Ah. Okay. A veces Ajá. le digo, look at the screen es que quiero que vean la pantalla. La pantalla, ok. Exacto. Exacto. Ajá. Eh, eso, porque si sí hay cosas que, que uno quisiera como comprenderla, va. Y. Como no es lo mismo que se escuche, como para escribirlo y, 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 e investigar, o sea, cuesta. Pero bueno, me entiende como... Pero ya me entiende más que antes, pero... Ya, yes, sí, por supuesto. Sí, o sea, y lo otro es de la pronunciación, pues que es la que creo que nos cuesta. Pero hoy pronunció no. súper bien. Escucha solamente esa parte en el video. Uh -huh. la, la, la práctica que hizo con Carmen le sirvió bastante. Es que ella, ella sabe bastante de, de, yo creo, tiene, obviamente que quizás ha estudiado en otro lado y, 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 y sabe como, tiene una buena pronunciación. De hecho, ella me corrigió algunas, algunas, muy, ajá, entonces por eso es de que. Muy bonito pronunció hoy, muy, ajá, muy bonito. Porque con la ayuda de la compañera, y cuando nos juntamos dos que no sabemos, <risa> es... Es un desastre. Ah. Pero gracias ahí, teacher, por, por la paciencia y por ayudarnos, porque la verdad es que el sueño es poder hablar fluido, entender más que todo, escuchar y saber comprender cuando estamos, escuchamos el inglés. Sí, Eso correcto. es lo que, lo que más me cuesta también comprenderlo. No es lo mismo la escritura, verlo escrito, que ya escucharlo, porque lo entiendo como más escrito que escucharlo. ¿Y está, ¿Qué está practicando aparte para, para escuchar? Ah, por ejemplo, eh, por ahí me he encontrado unas lecciones de inglés intermedio que creo que son unos españoles. Y entonces, eh, eh, pero he empezado como esta semana, como para poder escuchar una conversación. Okay. Entre, uh -huh. okay, okay. Entonces, pero intermedio, ese sí. no es un nivel todavía. No, verdad. Es no. como... No, no es intermedio, no me acuerdo, no, me la principiante, creo. Ajá. Ajá, entonces, pero la pronunciación la repiten bastante y digo, yo tengo que aprender, tengo que aprender. Cuando voy para mi trabajo, por ejemplo, voy un ratito, vengo de regreso, porque una vez llegué al trabajo, ahí no paro. Y ahora, por ejemplo, en un ratito no tengo que hacer las tareas porque las dejé a medias en la semana, pero gracias a Dios ya las terminé. Le voy a dar para que eh, practique, pues. Gracias, Ticha. Así que para que practique eh, listening, permítame. Um, I am going to forward a message to you. Okay. Ajá. Uh -huh. What is your phone number? Seven. ¿Cuál es su número de teléfono? What is your phone number? Eh, setenta y siete, setenta y uno cincuenta y dos, seis seis siete cuatro. Mm -hmm. I just sent to you three links that you're going to do that you're going to practice this week. Eso es para que los practique usted hoy. Okay? Okay, teacher. Thank okay. you. Very well. You have there the, the practice, two songs, two songs and one uh, practice for pronunciation. Okay? The basic. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, teacher. Very Thank good. you. Angie. Muy amable, oiga. Okay. Any teacher. other questions? Eh, por el momento, eso, ya cuando me toque, voy a anotarlas para tenerlas ahí como muy puntuales. 
Okay? Verdad. Very mm -hmm. good then. And it's been a pleasure. Hope you have a beautiful day. Thank you, teacher. You're um, welcome. Good night. Good night. Sí, igualmente. Bye, teacher. Bye-bye. Bye, teacher. Bye. -bye. Bye, teacher. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye.